Welcome to a video from JuiceLifestyle.com In this video I'm going to show you how you can get your surface dial working with Windows 11 There's a known issue with the surface dial and that's the virtual wheel that I've got connected here uh, on my uh, surface at the moment uh, well, There's a known issue where you can't add applications uh, to the to the wheel so for example I have this set up for the video editing tool so I had an application I map the um, the dial up to control the timeline in my um, video editing tool and then I can use the wheel to edit the video or system and edit the video and it worked in Windows 10 it doesn't work in Windows 11 it does work in the latest dev build version of Windows 11 but um, it doesn't, doesn't in this one so I'm going to show you the quick workaround so first of all I'll show you what happens if you try and add an application you get uh, this and settings crashes and then it's gone so you can't add them so I'll show you the, the way of fixing that so you go into settings network internet advanced go to data use so from the data from this data page here you type wheel to wheel settings and you should be able to add an app there you go so you can pick the app that you want to add so you pick the app you want to add so in my case it's Camtasia and now I can add the tool now unfortunately you, you have to repeat those procedures of going to the, uh, the network internet page each time you want to go back to this particular setting but of course you need to see a customization once and you can use your wheel so now that I can get in the settings uh, I've set up my Camtasia uh, with the uh, timeline editor tool so I go back to Cam Camtasia you can see here I'm using the wheel and I've got my editor working on there and I can I'm rotating around with the the wheel and I can do click or a, a, a tap which does the split function but you can customize it whenever you want so that's the idea that's how it works once you've been in these settings uh, and you close down settings then you'll have to repeat that step of going through network uh, settings again I don't know why that that uh, works but it does hopefully Microsoft will fix it they have fixed it on the latest dev build so hopefully that'll come through to the release build soon but anyway that fix hope that fixes it for you thanks for watching this video you can find out more on the